how to add categories to score site. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add the product category to your score site. So you are going to head over to squareup.com or app.squareup.com. Then you are going to sign in for an account. For this process to be possible, you need to have a online or the Square Online as a website for you. So you are going to click on online. If it is the first time that you're going to create an online or square online, you're going to have a setting uh, page and you're going to complete it. So once you have did that, you're going to get this dashboard. Now, what are we going to do is to head over the left side of the screen. We are going to see here the website, the items, the orders, the fulfillment, and etc. From here, we are going to click on items. It will drop down here at uh, this menu. We have site items and site categories. We are going to click on site categories. Before that, we need to see that everything is here. For example, for site items and etc. We're going to see the item category popping up. Here, the items are going to be in a library and this is very good. So we're going to ignore that step. So we are going to see the categories. We are going to start creating the category by clicking on this blue button. So we are going to insert a name for that category. For example, let's say here, clothing, for example. And we are going to drag and drop some images or an image to represent this category. You can go ahead and set up the, that this is a parent category. For example, you can go ahead and put it as a, a parent category. So for the channel visibility, you are going to put it for the website or the online store that you have on Square, which is going to be in my case unpublished, but it is okay, you are going to enable that. So you can add some items in here. So you can see here the items or the products that you have already added into the menu or the library. And then you are going to set up the availability, which is going to be an upgradable option and not a free option. So, and finally, we have the search and social media, which are going to be two choices here. Search engine optimization or the SEO for the keywords. You can go ahead and edit that. Set up the SEO title, the SEO description, and the permalink or the, uh, the uh, slug URL. Also, the preview on the search engines. And the final is going to be the social media links, like that, and then you are going to click on save. So when you have finished that, congratulations, you have created your own category and here we have it. Basically, that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.